to Daddy's little girl, whom she will always be. And I also now include Simon in their new unity. Life gets tough, this we all know, but stay true to each other and let the small stuff go. As you grow with each other in a newness of life, esteem one another, you'll never pay the price. Mm -hmm. Love what is good and hate what is bad. Raise your children this way, you'll be an awesome mom and dad. Simon, strive to obtain all your goals in this life, but do yourself a favor and cherish your wife. Keep opening those doors and showing your gentle side, but always remember to love your bride. Charity, my sweet, and my little precious Chi Chi. <laughs> Keep loving your Simon. Respect him and see he'll be one of life's greatest gifts from God to thee. So here we've all gathered on this your day. Most of us here, but others from far away, across the pond, you might say, <laughs> to share in your joy. And yes, have some fun, and to witness this union where two become one. So now, with a hip hip hooray <laughs> and a blessing of cheer, here's to your future and hoping grandkids are near. <laughs> I know it's not tradition for the bride to speak at a wedding, but I'm American, so we're breaking tradition. <laughs> um, we all know that Gina is not with us today, and I know she would have loved the day today. Um, but we wanted, first and foremost, to thank both Steve and Gina. Um, me, personally, for raising such a wonderful man. Um, woo! Yeah. yeah. <laughs> and I'm so thankful that I got to spend time with her before she passed and that I, you know, we got to get to know each other and I know she was thrilled that we found each other. Um, Steve, thank you, thank you for welcoming me to the family with open arms and all of you guys. You have been wonderful. You've taken me in as your own. One of the reasons I think that me and Charity get on so well is we share a lot of the same values and obviously she gets a lot of those values from you guys mm -hmm. <clears throat> and the way you were, uh, she was raised, etc. Uh, so you did a great job. So can we have a round of applause for John Ramsey? Finally, and most importantly, a huge thank you to my beautiful wife, Charity. Um, thank you for being you. I love you very, very much. Uh, <clears throat> and I can't wait to build our future together. In my opinion, we're definitely uh, <clears throat> the dream team. So can we have one big round of applause for Charlie? I met Preem when we were 10 years old at an old East cricket match where our dads introduced us and we've been best friends ever since. If truth be told, Preem was a bit of a nerd in his early days at senior school, <laughs> but then became very popular in the later years. You yeah. would think that's because he's a kind, generous, funny, great personality. No. <laughs> this was down to his mum's food portion sizes when we got invited <laughs> around the two. But I'd like to take this opportunity to uh, say what a wonderful woman your mum was and how proud she would be of you today. So I'll have a toast to um, absent family and friends. <laughs> Simon's had a few nicknames during his life. Preen, Hovis Head, <laughs> Cockamanu Saipelio Gigantai, <laughs> Big Daddy Love, <laughs> and my favourite, Machine. Uh -oh. He used to make us chant Machine, 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 every time he necked a drink. So cool of him. <laughs> so let's make him retire for one last time. <laughs> We decided to venture to Brighton for the stag do, a decision that sent shockwaves through our friendship group. <laughs> Surprisingly and ironically, as you will learn, out of everybody, Simon here was probably the most negative and vocal in our choice of destination. <laughs> Why Brighton, he would say. Of all the places we could choose to go, why have you chosen Brighton? <laughs> Known for its colourful reputation, <laughs> I was beginning to wonder if he had some skeletons in his closet he didn't want to reappear. 
their shared love of Mario Kart, <laughs> Jack Daniels, and EastEnders <laughs> was confirmation this was love. <laughs> Since then, they have grown as a couple, and here we are today. It feels like you guys have been together for an age already. Over the past couple of years, I know charity has been an absolute rock for both Simon and the family, helping get through some truly difficult times. Charity, I can't thank you enough. And it's an absolute privilege to welcome you into the family. On behalf of everybody here today, we wish you both all the love and happiness in the world. Yeah.